What's up guys, Nick back with another episode of Boost Fury. Last episode we dealt with a bunch of generators like we did in the first game. And now we are off into the next boss stage, so let's just go. And if you watch the anime, you know who this is. The end of stage 3. You'd think the Bobbity would vary up the decor a bit. Oh, shut up, go on. Everything looks the same. Hopefully the fighter on this stage would be worth it. Gohan, it's your turn next. This is maddening. You guys are acting like this is a game. Well, they're saying some dumbass. We've been lucky so far. But I think from now on, we should all fight together instead of fighting one at a time. Sorry, I yawned. Nah, don't worry so much, Supreme Kai. Whatever comes through the do that door, Gohan will be able to handle it. Besides, it will be unfair for Gohan, but Jin and I got our turns. This is Gohan's turn. Yeah, not to worry. Nothing to worry about. Boy, Gohan, I can't wait to see how you progressed over the years. You must be twice as strong as you were when you beat Cell. Well, actually, I'm not quite as strong as I was back then. Yes. Gohan's been too busy going to school and going out on dates for any serious training. Of course I could be wrong. Maybe he's been training between classes uh, or in PE class or something. Ah! Tapora! I can't believe Bobbity would send him so soon. It's only stage three. Pichinyakon. and Advancing to stage 3 is far beyond what any other mortal has managed to do. I was quite... It was quite unexpected. But now you must face me. Which means you will progress no further. <laughs> Your boss must be pretty nervous if he's, he sent out his number one guy. Let's just... Dispense with the idle talk. I'd prefer you all just attack all together. All of you together, sorry. Wait a second. It's my turn to fight. I'll fight you alone. Impudent fool. Very well. As you wish. He's actually pretty pathetic. Yakon took more hits. Look at that. I can't take this. <clears throat> I can't take this anymore. This is ridiculous. Why are we subject ourselves to this? Gohan is nowhere near as strong as he was when he fought Cell. Call him down, Kakarot. I'll take care of him. My, of this myself. Just give him time. He's not doing that bad. He's hanging in there. Spare me. Deborah is just toying with him. Whew. We're wasting time here. I could end this in five minutes if I wanted to. I'm here to help you guys create special father and son memories. I'm here to fight. I'm not here to fight. I'm not here to help. Sorry. Let's knock off all this sentimental rubbish. I'm the one who should be fighting, not him! Hmm. Master, are you there? Yes, Deborah! What is it? Please bring us back to the ship immediately. I have made an important discovery. It's something I'm sure you'll want to know. Huh? What are we doing here? I don't know. I guess they wanted us back at the ship for some reason. Why? Hey, what's going on? Are you giving up or something? Oh no, it's just a brief intermission. <laughs> I don't apologize, people. I'm just yawning constantly. Relax. We need to reward our strategy. Rework our strategy. It seems we found a new recruit. The perfect warrior capable of handling all of you. 
So, just take a rest while we get him ready. What is he talking about? They don't have a warrior stronger than Nabor. What's going on here? What are they up to? Arrgh! This whole thing would be over by now if it wasn't for you. I hope you're proud of yourself. You disgraced all of us with your pitiful performance. Piccolo and Krillin were turned to stone. That's because they're weaklings. Is that the kind of fate you want for yourself? To... <laughs> Do you want to be a garden statue? If they're lucky, someone will make a bird bath out of them. Maybe you're right. Maybe if you had fought Deborah, Krillin and Piccolo would be okay right now. You do-gooders aren't going to hold me back any longer. I'm taking control of this operation. And for starters, I'm going to blow this shit to Kingdom Come! Do you understand what you're saying? If you do that, you'll revive Boo. And if Boo is revived, this planet is finished. All living things will be exterminated. What happens to this planet is none of my concern. Oof. The strongest will find the way to survive, and the weaklings will perish. <laughs> yeah. Wait, what kind of person are you? Maybe Deborah wasn't bluffing. What if the perfect warrior Deborah was talking about is right here among us? Oh no, don't tell me. Vegeta is the one! <laughs> Vegeta, what's wrong? Bobbity is trying to take over his mind and enslave him, so he'll do whatever Bobbity wants him to do. Don't let him take you, Vegeta. <sighs> <sighs> Sorry. Let's let's go of the past. Let go of the past. <sighs> Don't think of this. Be innocent and clear. How can you say that? I'm not innocent. But you made the effort to change, Vegeta. You had to fight. Find, fight it, Vegeta! You have to stop it before it's too late! His power is increasing! It's monstrous! You have to stop this, Vegeta! It's too late. And he's a Super Saiyan. <laughs> Look at his forehead. It has an M on it, like the Bora. It's Bobby's symbol. Why isn't it a B at the end? never understood that. Why in Alpha Majin, duh? He's working for Bobbity now. I don't see the M on his head. No, just the M on his hair. What's the matter? You all look frightened. <laughs> Chapter 5 is Ma Majin the Cheeto. Do do do. Yeah! Oh great, what now? It seems Bobby has decided to transport us again. What the? Four people have appeared out of nowhere! How bizarre! This is highly unusual. For strange, four strange fighters have appeared in the arena, but the championship has already been decided. Yeah! I won this tournament fair and square! Excuse me, gentlemen. The championship has already been completed. There's always next year. That's okay. We're just gonna have a little exhibition match. Vegeta! This is your master Bobbity speaking. It's time for you to have a little fun. You can start by killing your friends. I won't. I am only here for to fight Kakarot. The others, they're nothing. A defiant one, aren't you? You'll come around eventually. <laughs> it's time, Kakarot. Vegeta, no! We're on the same side. They're making you do this. Fight it! No one is making me do anything, Kakarot. Oh, shit. Nah! 
He made stairs in the rocks. This is terrible. Oh, there's people! Vegeta, how could you? The Vegeta I know would never have done that. Well, actually... <laughs> he don't know Vegeta that well. So how about it, Kakarot? Are you ready to fight me now? This isn't the, the time, Vegeta. Vegeta? No. Oh? You'll, you'll fight me, Kakarot. Unless you'd like another part of the stadium to be remodeled. Uh, Vegeta, certainly you, you didn't do that on purpose. How sad. I didn't think you were weak enough to be controlled. How can you let yourself be a slave? Tell me, is a slaver when you get what you want? Stop this, both of you! Stand aside, boy. <clears throat> this doesn't concern you. It's between me and your circus clown of a father. <laughs> circus clown, that's a new one. Goku, no. If you fight him, you will be doing precisely what Bobbity wants. With every injury Vegeta causes, more energy will be sent back to the ship and Boo will be revived. Tell me, Vegeta. I know Bobbity has been giving you orders. Is this one of them? Are you trying to fight me because of him? Or is it the same old story between you and me? Which one? You know as well as I do, Kakarot. That at the end of this day, you'll be back in the land of the dead. I am not letting this opportunity slip by. Who are you people? Don't you see the fate of the universe is more important than your meaningless squabble? What do you know of meaningless? Spend most of your life ruled by another. Watch your race dwindle to a handful. And then tell me what has meaning other than your old strength. I have the blood of a Saiyan, Prince. He is nothing but a clown. Yet I have to watch him surpass me time and time again. He's even saved my life as if I were a helpless child. He's stolen my honor, and this debt must be paid. Bobby, I know that you can hear me. Transport us to a place away from people. If you give me that, I'll fight Vegeta. So be it. If you truly think you made the right decision, then you'll have to get around me to do it. I don't want to have to hurt you, Supreme Kai. Dad, what are you doing? He, he has prepared a Kamehameha, basically. Fine, do what you want. I can't stop you. Of course you can, bitch. I suppose there's no point in resisting. What can cannot be done? Helped. We will have to continue our efforts with a new strategy. While you two fight, Gohan and I will continue our assault on upon Bobbidi and Dabora. Oh no you won't! Don't! Vegeta, destroy the Supreme Kai! I refuse. What?! Your business with the Supreme Kai, it means nothing to me. Kakarot is my only objective. I'm serious, Vegeta! I command you to destroy the Supreme Kai! Get out of my head! I already told you, I will not be distract distracted from my goal. You may have invaded my mind and body, but there is one thing a Saiyan always keeps. His pride! Pride, pride, pride. Shut up, Vegeta. What? This has never happened before. Since when can my possess possess say no to their possessor? No matter. Have your fight with Goku. The results will be the same and Majin Buu will finally be released. That's the whole point. Let's go. I'm ready, Vegeta. That's good to hear. Now let's... Let us fight. What am I doing? I'm saving up for Kamehameha. Er... Super Saiyan 4. Boop, 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 boop. What?! Got it. Huh. 
Love what? I level up in the middle of the fight. Look, the spaceship is open. It's like they're inviting us to attack them. Be careful, it's probably a trap. But hopefully we can destroy Majin Buu before he's awakened with his full power. Uh, it should be the points first. See, even Vegeta still shows up. This isn't... This is it, Gohan. This is where we can find it. Oh, sorry guys, I had, I had to do something for you. Majin Buu is inside that thing? Yes, and we must act quickly. If we combine our powers, we might have a chance to destroy it. Oh, hello. I'm glad you could join us. We couldn't stop you, Bobby. Like you did my father. I'm afraid you won't be that easy, Supreme God. Screw it. <clears throat> unlike unlike my father, I have an eye for talent. Am I right, Deborah? I'm not doing voices right now. Not not theirs anyway. You're right, Bobby, Master. Listen, Gohan. We have to strike now before Majin Buu releases full power. And hold nothing back. And the enemy, they were outside, were they not? I don't know. Wait, Kai. Before you do anything, let's take this outside. It seems a bit cramped in here. Papara Papara! Bud said it looks like a ball of a ball sack, basically. Or a ball. I can't disagree. Deborah, feel free to dispose of the fools any way you like. Perhaps you can turn them into stone. Basically, just from now on, I'm not doing Bobby's voice. His voice really hurts. So I'm just doing his normally. Majin Buu, I'm only going to do his for a short time. Then I'll switch back because it hurts. No. I have something far more painful in mind. What is this? Could it be? But so soon? I don't believe it. Oh no, we're too late! Master, Bobbity, what's happening? Majin Buu is at full power. I don't understand. Goku's energy alone couldn't... Dad. Dad must be fighting at a level beyond Super Saiyan. Dad and Vegeta both. And when two powers like that collide with so much with that much energy. No. How could it could I let this happen? Amazing, G Vegeta. I'm amazed, Vegeta. These last seven years in the other world, I've been through the most intense training sessions. But we're still completely even. I guess this whole time, you've been pushing yourself even harder than I have. It's true. I push myself to the edge of my limits and beyond. But you've been born with a natural talent far beyond my own. This time I won't talk about Vegeta. Slightly different than Goku, but... No amount of training could have closed the gap between us. Today, as, I f as you fight Yakon, I realize that no matter how hard I try, I will never be able to catch up to you. So that's when I secretly made up my mind. You mean, you fool! You deliberately let yourself fall under Bobby's spell. Yes, I saw the power of Bobby's magic and I watched that farter spoke of it. I saw what his magic was has done and realized that it could also do the same thing for me. I have to say, I'm quite pleased with the results. Even if they don't come at a price, I'd say 
the, the <clears throat> end more than justifies the means. Vegeta, I don't understand. You've never allowed anyone to help you before in your life. Why start now? Because I wanted Bobby to reawaken the evil in my heart. I wanted him to return me to the way I was before. The way I was before! That's how you say it. I was a perfect warrior. But slowly I started to become one of you. My quest for greatness gradually gave, a, gave way to the life of mediocrity. Mediocre? Really? That's mediocre? Training under 400 times normal gravity and fighting intergalactic bad guys. Yeah, that's mediocre. I awoke one day to find that I had settled down and formed a family. I had even give, grown quite fond of them. That's why I needed Bobby. I needed him to set me free. Do you seriously believe what you're saying? You know, talk, Kakarot. We finish this now! We have to get out of here before Boo hatches. Run! No! I have to try and stop from hatch. Stop it from hatching. Fool! We need you alive, Gohan. I have to do this. Now step aside. What are you doing? Kamehameha! Ha! <laughs> Dead. It's empty! How could this be? Unbelievable! Gohan, you did it! You made a fatal mistake, Bobby. Just like your father, you were fooled by overconfidence and you underestimated your enemies, your opponents. Now the story of Boo finally comes to an end. Don't let yourself fool. Don't let that fool discourage you, Bobby. Even without Boo, we can continue our plan. Don't you understand? Without Boo, there is no plan. Do you realize what this means, Gohan? All we have to do is take off, take care of Bobby and Deborah, and everything will be back to normal. No, my attack wasn't strong enough to destroy the energy I felt in that egg. Something has to come out of that egg. But I don't sense anything. It's in the sky! Boo! Oh, that's a fat ass! Tell me, Master, is this Majin Buu? To tell you the truth, I'm not sure. I've never seen him before. The only one who would have be that annoying Kai over there. What's the deal, Supreme Kai? Is this the guy you were so afraid of? Yes. That's Bibidi's creation, no doubt. I could all I could never forget that disgusting creature's face. Supreme Kai hates fat people. Look at that face, Boo. I'm this look at my face, Boo, I'm the son of Bibbity, your creator. You can call me master. If it wasn't for me, you would still be trapped inside the, that ball forever. Don't turn your back on me. What is the meaning of this? I command you to turn around. The creature is nothing but a fool. I have great hopes for Machin Boo, but this deformed thing is nothing but a waste. <laughs> What's wrong? Do you have a problem with what I just said? Pow, 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 pow! Huh? <laughs> I guess Bobbity made a real mess of reviving Majin Buu. He's like an infant. No. There's been no mistake. Buu has always been this way. But then they tell a story where he wasn't like this. Run along, Boo, or shall I turn you into stone? POW! Oh! <laughs> the boy's like, oh shit! <laughs> that was just fantastic. Just remember, Boo, I'm well versed in all my father's incantations. 
I can put you back in that ball with a phrase if you like. Wait a second. I just felt a tremendous surge of energy. We've been fighting each other. While we've been fighting each other, that boo creature must have hatched. Boo is nothing to worry about. He may have ruled in his own time, but since then the Saiyans have evolved. Think about it. When we fought, when we fought with the Supreme God, it was the strongest fighters in the universe. He constantly underestimated our strength. You're wrong. I can feel something deeper inside Boo. Enough of your feelings. Boo is just a sideshow. You're my only concern. You're just stalling because you know I can beat you. Everyone on Earth will be killed. Can't you see that? Boma, Trunks, everyone. Shut up! They're nothing to me. I have a Saiyan heart that depends on on strength alone. I don't buy it. Talk all you want, but you better convince yourself of that first. Good God, there's a lot of cutscenes. Fine, you win. Our battle's postponed. You're obviously distracted. Too distracted. Vegeta! Don't just stand there. Give me... Get out of your sense of beans. Great. <clears throat> Sorry. I've been talking in voices all morning and it's kind of screwing with me. With all of us working together, I'm sure we can beat that... Beat this thing. This guy. Bap. So, even Kakarot can... Prove helpless when his guard is down. I'll take care of Boo myself. The last thing I need is... The clown claiming... Another victory for himself. To hold over his head. We'll finish this when I return. Enjoy your sleep. Now I can take care of, Majin, of this Majin Buu my way. First things first. I better destroy that wizard's ship. I wouldn't want him to having a chance to run away. You're not playing Vegeta. Destroy Majin Buu's ship. No. It's like you go backwards a little bit. Where is it? There it is. If you notice his Super Saiyan meter does not go down. Well, actually it does. But because Vegeta is always in Super Saiyan form, it can't go away. <laughs> Alright guys, that's going to be in this episode. I'm afraid there's going to be a lot more later. Sorry for yawning so much, I couldn't help that. And uh, no polls today. Yeah. I'll see y'all guys next time on the next Boost Fury where we go to destroy Bobby's ship. I'll see y'all later. Peace out.